In today's video, we're going to do something a little bit different than normal. We're going to do a comparison between the Battle Box monthly subscription box and the Crate Club quarterly subscription box. And stick around to the end, we're going to have a giveaway worth hundreds of dollars. That's what's coming up next here on Survival on Purpose. Welcome back to Survival on Purpose, your home for trustworthy information and gear reviews related to camping, survival, and general preparedness for regular folks. My name is Brian. Thanks for joining me here on a muggy afternoon. And as I said today, we're gonna to do something a little bit different. We're gonna take a look at two very popular subscription boxes. One is the Battle Box subscription box, and this is the little brochure out of it. It's a monthly subscription box related to tactical and outdoor kind of gear. And the other one is the Crate Club subscription box, which is a quarterly subscription box, also related to mostly more tactical style gear, some outdoor gear as well. So they, um, they have a, a lot in common. I think these companies are connected somehow, so there, there's a lot of crossover uh, between the boxes in many cases. Uh, there are also a few differences about the way they think, the way they operate, but one of the things they have in common is both of them are what's known as mystery boxes. In other words, you don't really know what you're gonna get until it gets there, so it's kind of a surprise. However, and here's where the sponsorship segue comes in, this video is sponsored by a subscription service in which there are no surprises. I'm talking about the folks at Acre Gold, where every month you give them a little money, and when you get enough money built up, they will send you a two and a half gram of real 24 karat gold. So the way that works is you can either do $30 a month or $50 a month. Obviously at 50 bucks a month, you're gonna get there quicker, but when your account has enough money in it to buy this two and a half grams of gold, they will send it to you in your hot little hands. No surprise, you know what you're getting and you know that what you're getting is gonna be valuable. So no, no, no mystery, no surprise there. And I think it's a great way for folks like you and I who don't have thousands of dollars just to dump on a bunch of gold to kind of almost it's kind of like putting gold on layaway, sort of, so to speak. So anyway, not only are they a sponsor, I'm a member, and this is my latest gram, uh, two and a half gram bar. So I think that's pretty cool. And if you want to learn more about that, there'll be a link in the video description below. But thanks again to the folks at Acre Gold for sponsoring today's video about some other subscription services, which are sort of a surprise. So with that being said, Oh, let's uh, talk about uh, the differences in these boxes, first of all. So this is a battle box. And Battle Box is a monthly subscription service with four levels. Um, each level is cumulative, so at each, at each increasing level, you pay a little more money and you get a little more stuff. And it's, it's based on what, what I mean by cumulative is that uh, it's just more stuff in addition to what you've already got. So, for example, the basic box is $30 a month plus shipping and handling. Uh, the advanced box is $60 a month plus shipping and handling. And then you get everything in the basic plus some more stuff. Uh, you see how it's going? The uh, Pro box is 110 bucks a month plus shipping and handling, and the Pro Plus is 160 plus shipping and handling. So four levels, and that's the way that works every month. And you can cancel any time, so there's no long-term commitment there. And you just cancel online. You don't have to send registered letters or anything like you have to do for your gym membership, right? Um, the Crate Club is a quarterly subscription service, so every quarter you get four boxes a year. And there are three different subscription levels there, and they, as far as I can tell, are not cumulative. In other words, um, there's different stuff in the boxes. There may be a little crossover, but it's not like you're just getting more stuff. They're, they're different, different mixes. So, and these levels are Lieutenant, which is the lowest level, is $50 a month plus, uh, $50 a quarter plus shipping and handling. And then you can also pay annually and it's 180 bucks, but, but you need to think about that and I'll tell you why in a minute. The captain is 100 bucks a quarter plus shipping and handling or 360 annually, so you, uh, you save a little money. And the general is $400 a quarter plus shipping and handling or $1,400 annually. Basically, you save 10% by uh, and, and you get free shipping, by the way, also with an annual payment. So you can save some money with an annual payment. However, uh, you really need to pay attention to this. Uh, both, these, both these crates, by the way, have no refunds. So once you've paid your money and ordered your box, you can't get it back because they base the, they have to buy the stuff to put in here and they base that on the number of orders they have. So I kind of get that. Um, so, but you're going to get the box either way. So that's good. Um, Crate Club, however, has no refunds on annual subscriptions. So if you buy an annual subscription and you get your first box and you just think, man, I don't like this, this is all, you're gonna get three more boxes, there's no refunds. That's what this plain, they're plain on their website about that. So um, 
you better make really sure that you're going to like it before you order annually. In fact, what I would suggest doing, is, if you want to try Crate Club out, is just to, just to do one quarter, see if you like it, and if you think it's going to be really great for you and you want to save some money, then maybe upgrade to annual, but you need to know that. So, without further ado, what I thought we would do is, uh, we're going to look at both these boxes, try to make it brief, and I've got the, the values down for everything. We'll talk about how, how much value is in each of these boxes for what you pay, and then hopefully that'll help you um, decide if it's something you're more in you're interested in checking out further or not. You know, as I always say, the reason I do these videos is not to tell you what you should do or try to convince you to do one thing or another. I'm just trying to show you an example of what might be in here so you can make an informed decision as to whether or not it's something you're interested in. Because I think you're smart enough to do that without me telling you what to do. And then at the end of this, I'm going to give away this Crate Club box and I'm going to give away this Battle Box. Um, and we'll talk about the details of that at the end of this video. So if you want to, you know, I guess you could fast forward to the end, but you stick around and see what's in here. You can see what you might have a chance to win. So first we'll start with the battle box. And, and I'm not going to get into too crazy detail with this stuff, but I'm just going to kind of, we're going to go through it. So um, at the battle box, again, the basic level is uh, 30 bucks a month, 29.99. We're going to call it 30. And for that, you get this stuff. This is what you're going to get in the basic box. You get a bottle of KPL knife pivot lube, and this stuff actually works. I put some on my knife yesterday, and it's a uh, butter smooth because it had a little bit of pocket crud in it. So you get this. That's $14.99. The next item in the uh, basic box is a quick cord battle box edition, and this is just a way to store some paracord tangle free and it's a pretty cool little deal it has a has a uh, little breakable you know snap light here for emergencies or whatever and you can actually um, pull this out down here you got a little cutter built-in cutter you just cut off as much as you need and there you go and what else is cool about this is and you can also use this to get this to get attention on the end of it, it's got a little lock so you can pull this thing lock in here you can actually um pull it over like so I think you, um, we'll just swing it, wrap it through here just to be safe. Sorry, I said I wasn't going to make it take a long time. But then you can snap this light and swing this around like this, you know, while, at night while it's lit. And you can get some, you know, make a signal out of it to get somebody's attention. So that's pretty cool. It's a quick cord battle box edition. It's giving us a $35.99 value. There's that. And then finally in the basic box, there's one more thing. It's this Outdoor Life Extreme Weather Manual. They're giving this a 3588 value and it's got like 214 tips for surviving natural disasters. I like books, those are pretty cool. So anyway, that brings the total value for the basic box, total stated value to 8586. So you're getting that for 30 bucks. The next, the next level in the battle box is the advanced box, which again is uh, 60 bucks plus shipping and handling. And at the vast box, you get everything in the, in the previous level. Plus, this is, I think, one of the coolest things I've seen in a long time, to be honest with you. It's a rest tube at beach. And what this is, it's a wearable. It's got a belt on it. You can put it around your waist. And it's kind of like a self-inflating little life preserver. It comes out to a tube about this big. I'm not going to inflate it here. But, um, but when I saw this, I thought of a story. And let me, so let me just tell you real quick, because you know i got to have a little rambling, right? I'll be quick. So uh, the last year I was a scout leader at Boy Scout Camp, we, we went down the Nantahala River in tubing. We used to do that every year. And if you're not familiar with Nantahala, it is in North Carolina. It is a pretty, pa pretty pa passive, kind of tame um, whitewater river. But we were, we, you know, we, had, we were in big rafts, right? I said tubing, we were in rafts. Anyway, one of the things that we do in these rafts, the kids love to do, is called riding the bull, where they get on the very front of the raft, hold on to the little ring, you know, put their legs over and bounce around on the rapids. It was kind of, you know, it's a fun thing to do. And again, this is not a super dangerous river. Long story short, we just got through some rapids. There was a kid on there that was about 11 years old, about three feet tall, probably weighed about 70 pounds, 60 pounds, and he's hanging on the front of this thing. And I noticed we're headed wide open towards this gigantic rock, and I'm hollering for him to get off, and he's not moving. And I'm thinking, you know, I'm going to be explaining to this kid's parents how I let him crush, get his legs crushed in, on, on the tamest river in America. So. I reached, I jumped up out of the back of the raft, grabbed him by his life preserver, snatched him back into the, to the, to the raft, and, and right before the raft hit the rock, and um, when it hit the rock, I went out like a flip booger. I'm in the water, it's like 40 something degrees in the Nantahala. I'm doing the, you know, the white water swim position with my feet up, trying to, trying to go into a couple of little rapids, and it was really cold, I'm having a hard time breathing, and I, and I literally, honestly thought, 
I, I may be going to die here in this lame, tame river. That be, you know, how embarrassing would that be to die? And, and you know, it wouldn't be anything, any, <laughs> no adventure there. So, and then another raft came up with a bunch of little kids in it, and they've got, you know, paddles that are this long. And when I get close enough to them to grab a paddle, they put their paddles in the boat and stick their little arms out, which are this long to me. And so I, then I really thought I'm about to die within touch of a, of a raft. But thankfully, obviously, I didn't make it. But if I'd have had one of these on, I'd have been a whole lot, whole lot more comfy. So anyway, that was a long way of saying I really think this is a really, really cool product. I've never seen these before. And I almost decided not to give this box away just because of this, because I wanted to keep it. But no, I'm gonna, this is going to be included in the box. We're going to do a giveaway. Anyway, the uh, value on this is $59.99. So that's the uh, advanced box. And that brings the total value of the advanced box to $145.85. So was that enough rambling about one item? But I just think it's really cool. The next level is a Pro Box, and the Pro Box is, again, was 100 bucks plus shipping and handling. Get everything in the previous levels, plus this is a, a Puncho, P-N-C-H-O. It's a Kalaloha Puncho. It's a reversible, packable down blanket. This thing's really lightweight, and it's, um, I had it out yesterday. I'm not going to take it out now because for, for time's sake, but it is 80 inches by 55 inches. It is down. It's got some snaps on it. You can fold it up and make a sleeping bag out of it, or you can use it for a blanket. Or um, It's just really cool. It's very lightweight, and I, I like it a lot. And the price on this one is 85 bucks, 84.99, which brings the total price, the total value for the Pro Box this month to 230.84. Finally, the Pro Plus, or I call it the Knife of the Month Club, is the highest level for Battle Box. And Pro Plus is 160 plus shipping and handling. And usually there's a knife or a tool or something. This month it is a stinking, really, really cool knife from my friends at Topps Knives. This one was designed by Craig Powell, who you've seen on some Topps videos if you watch any of those show videos. And it is called the Topps Poker. And he designed this for something just to cut uh, around the house, use, use as a tool around the house. It's got a nice, sharp, you know, like a razor edge blade. But he decided it would make a pretty good self-defense knife. And he put a ring on it here like a karambit. It's got this nice little, little kydex sheath here. And, and, and it's got the, uh, these nice little loops that, that, that will go um, either, you know, um, horizontal, vertical. You can mount it wherever you want to. Really, really cool. We'd give this in the little redneck sharp test just for kicks and my gosh. So another reason that I almost didn't want to give this box away, but I'm going to give it away. So anyway, that they're giving this $120 value from Tops. That brings the total value of this battle box to $350.84. So for $160. So not bad there, plus shipping and handling. So that is the uh, battle box mission 77. Now we'll take a look at the Crate Club, and it's got a lot of stuff in it, okay, I'm just going to go ahead and tell you a lot of stuff. First item in the Crate Club is a Peltor Sport Triflange, these are three piece, three, three reusable earplugs, they're 26 uh, noise rating, and these are $9.99 retail value, pretty cool there if you like to shoot like I do. Next item is, um, and by the way, as I said, every single one of these items have been in a previous battle box every one of them so i know they're connected so um and we'll talk about that real briefly but this is salty britches skin barrier ointment and it has a 12.95 value and it just prevents and soothes that chafing or blistering so we all know how bad that chafing can be right so there's that next item is underneath the bottom here let's get this out it is a Battle Tack Concealment Holster, and what this is, this is a plate that you can um, screw this to the bottom of a, of a desk or a chair or whatever. It's got a little elastic holster you can put your gun in. Um, if you need to get it, you know, have, have a firearm handy in an emergency. Um, one thing that concerns me about it is you got to be really careful with something like this because there's no tr really good trigger guard there, you know, no solid trigger guard, but, you know, use it at your own risk, right? The price on that is $24.95. So next, we've got a Ready Hour 24-hour kit. This is from Ready Hour in Salt Lake City, Utah, and it has 72-hour, I said 24, 72-hour food kit. It's uh, 1,600 calories a day for one person, and so $24.99 value for that. Uh, next, we have what I think is one of the coolest things I've seen from a battle box in a long time. I like this one a lot. I actually did a video, a dedicated video on this one. It's a full start fire starter which um, it's got some strings on it basically you pull the strings and it starts to fire it's amazing it burns for 30 minutes and it's, it's good in like a 200 mile hour wind 
this thing rocks a house. So there's that. And it gives, it's a $5.50 value. So something like this, you can put in a kit for anybody that has no skills and they can get a fire started. So that's a great thing to have, I think. So next, this Gear Aid Burry Drop Point Knife. And it's just a little uh, compact knife with a serrated edge, full tang. It's got a glass breaker. It's got a little paracord slot on it to tie it. It's got a bottle opener. It's got a nice little thumb release sheath. And the price on this one is $29.95. So there's that. But wait, there's more. Another item we've reviewed in detail on the channel, and I really like this by the way, it's a Gerber Freescape camping saw. So this one has a value of 55 bucks. Pretty cool item there. It folds out into a bow saw, so it's pretty neat. Next, another pretty cool item, a very nice uh, flashlight with a rotatable head. You can turn it to 90 degrees or turn it straight. Um, it's got a magnetic base on it, a rotary clip, three colors, LED, either you got red, green, or, or white. And the price on this is $54.99. Next is a Lord and Field. Oh man, I like this one too. It's a Lord and Field bushcraft grill set. And it comes in this nice wax canvas pouch. And it's got some some um, steel and a steel grate and, and a way to basically you can set up this thing and it suspends this over a fire so it lets you cook on a fire. It gives you a nice grate to cook over a fire. That's pretty cool. And it's got this nice wax canvas pouch, so kind of handy there too. And old school cool, right? So there's that. Uh, next is another knife. Um, it is the Revolt Remove Knife. Got an, a Kydex sheath, nice push off ramp here. And this one has got, it has, it's got, it has a, my grammar's horrendous, I'm sorry. A, uh, there we go, push it down, pull it out. A little, a little gut hook in the handle so you can keep from getting the, uh, you know, intestinal juices all over your meat when you're, when you're gutting a deer or an, any animal, I suppose. It doesn't have to be a deer. There's that, and they're giving this $119.99 value. Oh, I forgot to tell you, the uh, Lord and Field set is a $74.99 value, so there's that. And finally, one more thing, and that is the Fox Edge Dundeal Knife. We looked at this one as well earlier, and so it's from Fox Edge, and it is a uh, model FE009, really nice little knife. Got this little finger thingy here. Uh, it, it feels really, really good in my hand. It's, it's, got, it's got a tech lock style clip on the back of it. Price on this one is $89.99, which brings the total value price of the stuff in this um, general edition of the Crate Club to $503.29. And the cost on this again is $400 bucks plus shipping and handling. So let's just talk about the comparison between these, these two boxes. Uh, Battle Box to me uh, seems like a better value right now because we have basically $350 worth of, of stuff in here at retail for 160 bucks. Here on the other one we've got 500 bucks worth of stuff, just a little over 500 bucks worth of stuff for 400 bucks. So obviously almost double on the Battle Box and about 20% more value on the uh, Crate Club. Think about this, if you spent almost the same amount of money on Battle Box, so the Pro Plus is 160 bucks a month. If you did that three times, that's gonna be 300, 480 bucks. So, um, heck, just do it twice. That's gonna be 320 bucks. And if you got the uh, same uh, kind of value there, that'd be $700 worth of value for 320 bucks versus 500 for 400. So, to me, the Battle Box offers a lot more value. So there we go. So anyway, that being said, Let's talk about the giveaway now. So um, first of all, thanks to the folks at Battle Boxing Crate Club for sending me these. So, but we're gonna do a giveaway. And as I said, man, we're gonna give away both of these. First of all, sorry, but this is gonna be for the USA address only because these boxes are heavy, especially this Crate Club's heavy. I think this food is pretty heavy. So I, I don't know how much it will cost me to ship it overseas. It's not gonna be cheap to ship it to the US. So anyway, sorry, US only. And here's how you're gonna enter, okay? Pay close attention because this is important. You're going to go to survivalonpurpose.com slash giveaway. There'll be a link in the video description. And there's going to be a form on that page where you can enter your name, your email address, and your YouTube username. Um, I would like for you to be subscribed to the channel. So if you're not subscribed to the YouTube channel, just click right down here and you can, uh, you can take care of that. And go ahead and click that notif not notify me button or whatever it is. So if you don't see a form on that page, try a different browser. Okay? It doesn't work for me on Firefox for whatever reason. Google Chrome worked, Microsoft Edge works, I know that. Safari works, so there's that. 
Second of all, uh, in the name spot, for whatever reason, don't put a number. Don't put like Tom number two or Tom two or whatever. Somehow it, can, it makes it look like spam and they try to filter out spam because they don't want you getting spam or me getting spam. So no numbers in the name spot. Those two things, that's, that's pretty much the housekeeping. And then third, use an email address that you're going to check that will show up because if you don't, get, you won't know if you won because I'm going to notify you with email, but you won't even be able to enter because the way you enter is when you enter your information, you click that, click that enter, submit, or whatever it says there, a little button. It's going to take you to another screen that says, hey, be looking at your email for a confirmation email. Look at your email. When you see that email, confirmation email from Survival on Purpose, you've got to click a link in there. It's basically telling, telling my email uh, software people that I've got permission to send you emails because they don't want to be, get in trouble for spam. So there's that. Once you do that, you're going to be entered. You're also going to be subscribed to my weekly email newsletter. Um, if you don't want to get that, then you can definitely unsubscribe. But I do giveaways there too sometimes, and there's some other stuff you might be interested in. So you might want to stick with it. I get one email a week, okay? I'm not going to be that guy that's sending emails, two or three emails a, a day into your, into your box. I'm not going to do that. Um, <clears throat> and then we're going to pick a winner on August the 31st. So August 31st, we'll draw a winner for both of these boxes. And one more quick note, if you're already a subscriber to the, to the email newsletter, you still need to go to survivalonpurpose.com slash giveaway and enter this, this drawing. Um, and you won't get double emails or anything like that, but this, this drawing is, the, I'm gonna pull that list of, of people that have, that have entered the giveaway list, and that's, that's where I'm gonna pick the winner from, with a random drawing. And we're gonna do it on August 31st. I may do a live stream and just see how many people wanna tune in and see that, but um, we'll talk about that um, uh, in some uh, weekly emails. So if you wanna stick, at least stick, stick with the subscribe, subscription to the weekly newsletter for, until the giveaway is over, if, if, you, if you don't want it at all. So anyway, Hopefully that's it. And look, if, if, you, if you don't get your confirmation email again or whatever, just try it again. Try a different, a different browser or whatever. I can't enter you manually. I'm not, I'm just, I don't have the technology to do that. This is a service that I, I subscribe to that, that handles all this. So anyway, that's the giveaway. And you get a chance to win. Um, both these boxes are over, over you know, three, four, and five hundred dollars worth of stuff. So hopefully that's a pretty good deal for you. So anyway. I say anyway a lot, don't I? Um, that's it. I'm going to shut up now. Thanks for watching Survival on Purpose. Remember, my name is Brian. Survival's not an accident, so be prepared. I'll see you next time.